Hello viewers welcome to TutorSweb student sign-in page. This is a student login, we are into dashboard. You could see over here upcoming sessions. Based on your scheduled time and scheduled date. So, whenever your session is about to happen. Based on date and time this join class will get enabled. Click on this join class, this will redirect to the MIC classroom page. You could see the whiteboard desktop and hand raise queries. There are three modules over here. And there is a webcam where student can view a tutor and tutor can view the student. Below there are two options. One is participants, so a tutor can see whoever is participating in this session. Now let's come to the whiteboard part, you could see various options available here. Selection, pencil, rectangle, circle, oval, line etc. There is a pencil similar like paint you can write by using pencil. This is a rectangle, circle, oval, here it's a line. This is a text, when you click on it you could see default as hello world. You can type anything over here using keyboard, you can select drag and drop across the canvas. This is an option to remove the shape. The shape whichever you wanted to delete, first select it click on remove the shape will get deleted. This is for clearing the whole canvas. This is an image PNG output it is just similar like screenshot, once you click over here the screenshot has been captured in an another tab dot which is into PNG format. Same way you could also take the screenshot in PDF format. So, the file is downloaded here and saved in default downloads location dot same screenshot in PDF format is seen. There are two options at the end called fill and stroke which is used for colors. Click on it and choose the color you wished to, let's select orange. So, this will be written in orange color. Go to selection and select the shape and fill the required color into the circle. The whole content will be cleared by clicking on clear canvas option, there will be a prompting message. Whether to clear or cancel. If you select the cancel it cancels the action. If clicks OK the complete canvas be cleared and start freshly. Now I am going to desktop, you can share the screen. Before you go to screen sharing there is one Insta VC screen sharing extension which has to be added in the Chrome. I already added with this extension so didn't prompt me. However Google Chrome ask you to install it. I have two options one Tutor Sweb Google Chrome screen and another is entire screen. I go ahead and share TutorSweb Google screen with the students. I have two options one is hide and another is stop sharing. Hide will hide the screen share and stop sharing will stop the screen share. I click on stop sharing, the sharing gets stopped. Next moving to another section hand raise queries so this is for students who want to ask their queries to tutor without making it publicly visible. Here below webcam there is an option called hand raise queries. Student has to click on it and type down his dobia which will go to tutor where he can view and revert back to the queries by clicking on revert. Else he can also delete the queries. Here there is an option called recording, where tutor can add recording which will prompt you for an extension which has to be added to the Chrome. Just click on add to Chrome this will be added in extension and tutor can start recording the session. That's all about from my classroom, thank you for watching and thank you so much.